Congratulations, you're approved for a Credit Ninja personal loan. Here's how to navigate the customer portal where all of your loan and repayment information is kept. After logging into the portal at creditninja.com, you'll land on the home page. Here you can quickly see your loan status, the due date for your next payment, and how much your next payment is. There's also a make a payment button for when you're ready to make your current payment or get ahead on payments. Next, let's head over to the profile tab. Here you'll see all your personal details like your name, address, email, mobile number, and pay frequency. Whenever you need to make an update, just click the pencil icon next to the information you wanna change. It's a quick and simple way to keep your account details current. Now let's look at the loan information tab. This section highlights key details about your loan, including your next payment due date, the amount due for that next payment, and the current payoff amount if you wanna settle your loan today. This tab acts as a simple overview for when you want to quickly check when your next payment is. Now let's check out the Contracts tab. This is where you can view and download all your important loan documents, your loan agreement, arbitration agreement, and recurring payment option. Your loan agreement outlines the terms of your loan, including interest rates and payment schedules. Your arbitration agreement explains how any disputes would be resolved outside of court. And your recurring payment option provides details about your automatic payments. Remember to save these documents in a secure place, because keeping track of your contracts is one of the most important things to do after getting a personal loan. And subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss our upcoming video on how to raise your credit score in just 30 days. And for the most important section for staying on schedule, with repaying your loan, we have the Payments tab. Right at the top, you'll see the next payment due date and the amount. Below that, you have the option to make a payment. You can switch between upcoming and past payment dates and amounts. You can also link a debit card for automatic payment. It's a quick way to stay on top of your payments and ensure you never miss one. Head over to the Add Card tab, then select the blue Add Debit Card button. You'll be prompted to enter your card details, and you're all set. That's it. You successfully added a debit card and are ready to start paying back your loan. Your payments will automatically come from your bank account or debit card, but you can also log in to manually make payments if you like as well. Okay, so that wraps up this tutorial. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.